Hi! In this tutorial, I will show you how to create this triple stacked parade with the flower parade. First, take a small piece of hair, which you will leave for the stacked parade. Take this section and leave it off. Then, take a piece of hair, separate it in two pieces and start the French pistol parade. Take a small piece from the side and bring it over to the other side. Small piece from left, bring it over to the right side. Then small piece from right over to the left. Small piece from left over to the right. Small piece from right over to the left. Next I start to add some hair from the right side of the braid. Then I bring the left strand over to the right. Again small strand from right over, add some hair and add this section to the left side. Left over to the right and right over to the left with some new hair. Left to the right, right to the left, add some hair. Left to the right and right to the left. With this parade, it's very important that you keep both strands equal sizes. So when I take hair from the left side, I take a little bit bigger piece. And when I take hair from the right, I take smaller section of hair. And then I add hair to create these sections about same sizes. You will notice if the another strand is growing and the another won't. You can also pancake the braid if you like. Then just continue braiding until the braid reaches on the back of the head. After last addings, continue parading few stitches more so the braid will be easier to connect to the another braid. Next, I will secure the right sided section with an elastic. Next, I will create the stacked braid. So take a section you left out first, three strands and start the braid, regular three strand braid. Once the parade is finished, I add it to the Fistel parade. Yet, repeat the same to the other side. Next, I connect these small braids. Remove the elastics and then bring the rightmost strand from each braid into one, the middlest strand into one from the both braids and the leftmost strand into one. Then I start the braid and I add some hair for each strand. And that's why, because in this way I can make sure that this braid is long enough. After addings, just keep on braiding until the end of the hair.
Then I connect the Fisto braids in the one on top of the micro braid. Cross the strands and remove the elastics. Then you are ready to start. Take a small piece from the left, bring it over to the right. Then small piece from right over to the left. Small piece from left over to the right. Small piece from right over to the left. Small piece from left over to the right. And so go on. Next, I add the micro braid into the fist style braid. Next, I will take some extra hair under the fistel braids. I pull this section up and then I separate it in two pieces and one piece again in two and then I start to create rope twist braid. So twist, spin, twist, spin, twist, spin, twist, spin. Pancake the another side of this braid. Notice that when I twist, I twist on this time to the left, and then when I spin, I spin strands around each other to the right. That's how I can make the twist last after when I don't hold the strands on my hands anymore. Repeat the same process with another strand. Next, I spin these braids into a flower using poppy pins. Next, I lift the braid up and start the braid under the braid. Take a section of hair and separate it in three pieces. Then start the French braid. Bring strands from sides over to the middle. Add hair from the both sides using the strands are most further from the braid. 
Bring the right strand over and add here. Left strand over, add here. Right strand over, add here. And left strand over, add here. Keep on going like this until you braided all the hair into this braid. And here's the final result of this hairstyle. Thank you for watching this video. Have a lovely day.